Let's go inside the coach's corner now and catch up with Chris Bosadix's Chris Hawkins. And Chris, we could start at so many places in terms of a theme for discussion to get to Indianapolis, but I'm going to let you tell me where do you want to start. Um, I just think uh, it's just a real big uh, for our community over at Christmas Addicts, the alumni, um, just this, this whole run we've been on. Uh, you know, the season started off kind of rough as far as, you know, first four games, I think we were 2-2. Two and two. I just think with the kids just trying to get used to me, we get used to the kids. And then from there, we've progressed to where they've uh, trusted uh, the system that I brought in, and then I've trusted in them to go out and uh, make plays. So uh, it's been one of the one of the most enjoyable coaching rides that I've ever had. Uh, you know, coming from Buff last year, uh, being with Todd Howard for two years, and then coming over here with my own system, uh, you know, just seeing if it would work, and uh, we're in the state championship game. So The kind of challenges that you meet on an everyday basis, especially as your competition increases uh, in the state tournament, that means that perhaps these kids can uh, have to trust one another even more. Yeah. I mean, if you look at just our section, I mean, we had to go through, uh, depending on if we had to play Burbuff, but we had to play Mango. Our section was one of the toughest ones in the state. Uh, we played Tinley. Uh, we played uh, uh, Louisville Wagner. We played uh, just a high-level schedule the second half of the uh, season. So I was prepared. We played North Central. Um, it's a game that went down to the last buzzer. So uh, the kids have, have, have trusted and understood what we try to do. I think with the, the type of pace that we play with, the kids understand uh, that we're going to be in there at the end of the game, and uh, they've been doing great so far. When you think back, uh, Addicts not having been to the state finals since 1959, that's a long time ago, 58 years. I was just wondering what year your parents might have been uh, born. Uh, around that time, but like my mom's from Alabama, my dad's from Mississippi, uh, my dad's uh, a basketball person, enthusiast. He likes Ole Miss, Mississippi State. I talked to him. I said, none of those teams have made it to the NCAA tournament in a while. So, uh, you know, you can become an addicts fan. And, Coach, it looks like the bandwagon is getting pretty crowded right now because the crowd you had at Seymour was big. Oh, yeah. It's a lot of a lot of people coming back out saying they're alumni. Um, so it's just good that everyone's getting on board and coming out and helping us and doing exactly, uh, you know, what they – what they want to do, they want to support addicts any way possible. I've had uh, a lot of numbers call me, don't know who they are, but they just call, congratulate us on the success that we have, and um, I'm appreciative for the support, and hopefully they come out uh, this Saturday. Early is regarding strategy for Saturday, but as far as your opponent is concerned, what do you think? Um, they can shoot the ball. They try to slow you down. Um, I think they only give up around close to 46, 47 points a game. So, uh, like I said, it's going to be contrasting style to see if we can get them to go up and down. But uh, we're going to have the guard shooting with the guard sets, uh, pick and rolls, different things like that. They have a guard that can get to the lane and do some things and then have a couple of shooters. So kind of reminds me of a buff. Um, so we'll uh, – We'll be for we'll be ready. Our coach, assistant coaches are looking at film right now. So, Flying Tigers tradition so deep. And when I mention these kind of names, I want you to give me your reaction. The Big O: Bill Hampton, Edgar Searcy, Laverne Benson, Willie Merriweather, Stan Patton, Al Maxey, Jerry Hazelwood, and the list goes on. I mean, just legends, uh, great people, uh, great people in the community, great basketball players. Um, and we're just glad to, you know, uphold that legacy and, uh, you know, try to start a new one here, hopefully this weekend. Best of luck. Thank you. Chris, you mentioned some of those numbers. Who, who, who have you heard from? Have you heard from some of the some of those names he listed there? Uh, we, uh, 